Hello and speak Bamboo and as much as I doubt they'll actually put comments in this video, I would still love to see them. Now if he's gonna do this, reaction videos are still live on my channel. That's if he keeps on making these thoughts videos on my reviews. And of course he's doing it on my latest review. And of course I wanna read the description because it's so wrong. Can you stop hate Angry Birds as a franchise? First off, that's English. Shouldn't you say, can you stop hating Angry Birds as a franchise? Second off, it's a question. Where's the question mark? And then he says new videos arrive tomorrow. Well, that's okay. At least he's no longer saying on tomorrow. That's good. And this is the first time in, like, forever that he's actually using his Mikey de Armas account to put a comment in. Don't know why he decided to do that, but... Hey, he did that. So, I'm just going to watch this video. And hopefully, I won't lose my sanity. And of course, I've got to turn it up. And maybe it was a good thing that that reaction video on his reaction video on my end of Big Run Bot video can up. So, the very beginning of the video, I stretched my arm over there. You could see it, and it really distracted me, but I don't know if it w would have distracted anyone else. But the second clip with <laughs> Thordio died, so that didn't come to be. So anyway, I'm just going to watch this now. Just checking the audio is 100% perfect. That was very nice of you, SpongeBob, but that was for the people who actually had their birthday on that day. They were non existent. Well, of course, someone had born on that day might have been watching it, but yeah. Hey guys, this is my game is here. Now, first, I want to comment on his new iPod recordings. Now, Surely it's nice and all that it's all in better quality, but there was something about his old camera which had something magical about it. I don't know what it was, but the, it was like the blurry visuals and the kind of blurry voice made it kind of magical. It felt interesting. Now, I didn't care when I first watched them, but now that he's got a new camera, it's so noticeable and the magic just didn't transfer. I don't know what it is, it's just, it's just something about the old recording that I loved a lot more. But this is a permanent change, so I should stop complaining. So sorry that the, I see it just because the, like my, the original iPod touches pretty slow so hopefully the, this is actually a pretty gonna be HD for now because I just HD is actually this iPod touch is actually a lot faster than the other one because that's more faster quality so yeah so on to the fonts so yeah Big Ben Bots Fachi released the, the fonts on the Angry Birds Angry Birds classics not just Angry Birds classic yeah I just I just call it classic or Angry Birds uh, 1 yeah, just call it one. I just call it Angry Birds, but since you have every Angry Birds game in existence, maybe with the exception of Angry Birds Stellar Pop, I really shouldn't be surprised. So yeah, just clear to see that I'm just watching the Super Bowl for no reason, so yeah, because it's just a late, it's just a late Fox video. So yeah, I know that, yeah, so basically that, after I just unsubscribe him, because a lot of a lot of crazy stress, even though he has angry issues and he is autistic. I know he has like pretty cr angry autistic. Yeah, I guess my mom always always say it. But yeah, I know this kid. I know you. Are you saying I have anger issues? 
First off, I personally don't think I have anger issues. And second off, I know people with much worse anger issues. And first off, you shouldn't trust your mum on who you should be, be allowed or not be allowed to subscribe to. Just have freedom. Just subscribe to whoever you want. You don't need someone to boss you around. Just have freedom. You do not need your account controlled by a parent. In fact, I don't even give any of my YouTube secrets away to my parents. I'm angry autistic. Stuff. Yeah, I know. And also, and also this infamous part is, is my start. How could it be infamous if the review isn't even that popular? Do you realize that you can always subscribe again? Where's it coming from? I recognize that tune. Yeah, this is just catchy. And I still have no idea why he unsubscribed. That does not explain enough. He just said because of anger issues. Everyone gets extremely angry sometimes. And it took you this long to unsubscribe despite all of the times I've been angry in the past? As in, more angry than in that one video where you decided to unsubscribe? He's gonna complain about anger issues again if I don't shut up. Oh yes! Angry Birds! This will be perfect! After his name is Mikey! <laughs> What's so funny? You were the one who created your name. Yeah. yeah, so. So, were you happy that I reviewed Angry Birds? What were your thoughts on the review? Did you like the jokes? Did you like the music? Uh, what songs did you recognise? Because I can tell you what they are. And. Keep talking. That's just a perfect part to begin it. So here's the here's the pros. So basically, it's the same day as my birthday because I was born like back in 2001. Now, and we all know that something being released on your birthday is an instant positive. <laughs> it's gonna be because I'm just late for the party for the for that react for that Fox video. Because I'm just gonna be like making pause videos and your react to your videos. Because reaction video will be YouTube poop videos, some game I will play. And also, there will be like. For of course, it's sad that he stopped making reaction videos. I wonder why he stopped. He he was perfectly comfortable doing it for a year, and then he just stopped. Well, I never had less fun. Mm. That's why I'm still doing them. First of all, games I will get to show you. So yeah, okay, then just onto it. Oh yeah, that's was a I wanna poster. Yeah, I know because he has like. What did you just say? Uh, just onto it. Oh yeah, that's was a I wanna poster. It's not an Elsa and Anna poster. If you knew anything, it has, it has nothing to do with Frozen. In fact, it's a screenshot from the Princess Sophia episode. Wait, I mean, I meant Sophia the first, whatever. Holiday in Enchanting Sia. Not, it's not Frozen fan fiction. Yeah, I know, because he has like... Plus he has some lot of pros of this game because it's had just a lot of memorable, memorable characters. Yeah, I know because they actually did it. Memorable characters with no personalities whatsoever. Has some a lot of. The only reason why I remember them is because of the designs. Kind of like how I remember the characters from the original version then, their designs, and not solely because of their personalities. However, these pigs don't even have personalities, and the birds so. I have to rely on their designs. Plus, they actually got their own personality when the t cartoon Angry <laughs> Tunes actually is like the best. Yeah, I know. But you don't need a TV show. But you don't, wait, 
but you don't need a cartoon to explain or to give your characters personalities. You should not do that. You should give them personalities in their games and maybe you could expand on them in a TV series or a cartoon. But they should have personality in the games. Even Stella is amazing, so... Yeah, even though your favorite... Yeah, she's got no character in this first game and... Uh, I don't get it. This looks ugly. Like an ugly barnacle. <laughs> yeah. You don't have to comment on me being ugly. In fact, you're ugly too, in my opinion. I just... What the heck happened? I just, just say that. Sorry, people. Sorry, dude. Okay, let's see. The pros is... The pros are... Now that's the one mistake tons of people make in English. Now when... Especially when, whenever they're using to be, you know, you've got I am, you are, he is, she is, it is, we are, and they are. People always get the he, she form and the they form mixed. I mean, they, they people often say things along the lines of they is, it are, he are. It doesn't make any sense. It's incorrect. It's grammatically incorrect. Finally, we finally get to show it on TV rather than just show it on the iPad or iPod Touch. But I've never reviewed an iPad or iPod Touch game, so why would you even say that it's a good thing that you're seeing on the TV rather than the iPod or the iPad? Like, and that's what you've always been seeing. But Apple TV, which is a good thing. I know that I was actually put it on PC, iOS, Android, uh... Basically everything have a... PS3, PS3, PSP, um, Blackberry, was it Blackberry? I think. Yeah, it's like so many ports I just saw. Yeah, even, uh, even Trilogy got the Wii, Wii U, D 3DS, PS3, 360, and... Let's see, what's next, um... PS Vita, I guess? Was it PS Vita? Yes, and Xbox One and a ton of other things. Oh, darn it. Oh, gosh darn it. <laughs> Bonicles. Yeah, which is a pro because even though there's so many consoles that Angry is actually ported, I know this is actually just my my opinion. How many consoles they actually you ported it? No idea. Way too many. That's how many. Way too many. Yeah. So, yeah. Just focus on some, some stuff. Yeah, because at the TV, you can I can finally see what do I see, and also here's some lot of some lot. Of Is he making this point because he couldn't really see whenever I review Portal games? Of minor negatives, he didn't remember the bird's name. Yeah, I just actually just remember. The reason why I didn't re uh, the reason why I don't remember that bird's name is because I don't give a beep. Remembered in all the ner names of the birds are, which are red, chuck. Did you really think I was gonna re remember all of the? Uh, you really think I was gonna revise all of the names off of Wikipedia? Because if your answer is yes, then you are very wrong. Blues, J Jake, and Jim, which are the, which are the, uh, yeah. Um, Oh, uh, just uh, like, just put cross-eyed or something. Yeah. You know, my parents are actually watching the Super Bowl, too. Okay, sorry. Let's just uh, focus on the stuff. Yeah, focus on the stuff, not the Super Bowl. Um, let me see. Um, let see. <laughs> Bomb, uh, Max, aka Matilda, as a girl. Yeah, Max is a male. Yeah, Matilda is a female. Hal, or Al, if you like to call it. If you like to call him. Um, Terrence. Bubbles and Stella. Oh, even the Angry Stella characters are Poppy, Luca, Willow, and. But Dylan. they're not even in this Luca, game. Yeah. yeah, I know because they're. Hopefully, if he's gonna review like the uh, Posse Rio and Season, sometime at least during Christmas or something, or 2016 when the new Angry Birds movie year two weeks. Do you really think I'm gonna review the, the cartoon series? Well, you're in deep beep. Yeah, hopefully it wasn't a monstrosity. Yeah, okay, but this is just, like, just focusing on here. 
a monstrosity? You mean like your top tens? Okay, that was a harsh joke, but he called those videos monstro monstrosities. The, the review itself so great. Yeah, yeah, because he didn't remember all the birds' name, which is the negative. Um, not so hilarious parts are the reading dictionary, the blacky Angry Birds music, even the infamous part you are about to see. What infamous part? No parts in this video can be in infamous, so I'm gonna find out. I mean, yeah. Harry Potter as a game, I just don't keep it as a franchise. Well, I like it as a franchise, but there's too many games of it. Well, even you're admitting that there's too many games in it. Do you think there's too much merchandise? Do you think that the movie deserves to exist? Do you? Why is it just only nine? Here's the infamous part. No parts in this video can be infamous if it's not well known by many. You're, you're, he's just imagining this universe where I'm really popular and this part is infamous in that universe. Yeah, because this is just people who actually said that there's gonna be only one pig in the Am My Angry Birds 3 Reloaded movie. You know, there will be like, like more pigs characters who are actually not gonna be... I know this is about Angry Birds, but this isn't about my review. You should solely be giving your thoughts on this review. Just like you did in that top that top 14 video. You heard me. Kidnap someone else. Just just have something happen. Possibly some kind of apocalypse. Apocalypse? Some kind of Don't you mean apocalypse? Vision or something? Some pretty like dangerous some incoming um, epidemic or something, some crazy bite of eight seven or also something else. Okay, the, yeah, that's just an infamous part. Now, so you just like just don't remember the names of the levels, like the bird. The levels don't even have names. I mean, who can forget such memorable levels as ten six, nineteen three, three seven. And my personal favourite, 2110. I have no idea what those levels contain. Hoax eggs, mighty hoax, danger above, um, my favourite. Ah, the level names of the hub, hub worlds. Now, of course, I knew, I kind of knew their names because it says so in the game. But, here's the thing, I didn't think it was worth mentioning, and, well, I just gave you the generic summary of them, like I always do, you never complain before, and now you're complaining with Angry Birds, you picky hypocrite. Here it has to be, big setup, um, next one. Ham and high, ham high or something, was it ham high? Yeah, and also the shockwave bomb, yeah, I just forgot the shockwave bomb, that's just overpowered, like, like freaking Meta Knight from Smash, from Brawl, that's just crazy, yeah, her Kirby character who is the most powerful in Brawl. I actually didn't feel like, yeah, Meta Knight was that overpowered in Brawl, but that's just my opinion. Was nerfed, it's a good thing, and also the, yeah, that's a tree level, that's a tree level. You know, looks more Pac-Man like. Yeah, he just com I think he's confused as Pac-Man. Yeah, and also the. No, I didn't get confused with Pac-Man. I just compared it to the tree level with Pac-Man World Two and the tree le the tree world and. I well, just compared it to the tree worlds of Pac-Man World Two and Donkey Kong Country Three. Big setup there. You could have is a construction work looking thing. Um, Ham high, yeah, that's a Wild West level. It wasn't the desert, you know. Well, Wild West actually take place in the desert. Maybe they might be the Egypt level. Um, the, the, the birthday one, which are two, three, four, which are three levels. Then birthday five, or birthday 2.0, which is actually some, a lot of fans actually create their own levels. Like, possibly the competition. I see a lot of competition, yeah. Yeah, the Did you make any of those levels? This is, that's Stella. That's really Stella. And also, the, he didn't remember. 
I do know that he didn't remember all the pig's name. Yeah, Corporal Pig and Foreman Pig. Do you really think I'm gonna remember their names too? Pigs are the official names for Robio. Yeah, birds have personality, so... Not in the games. Yeah, I know that. Just like the birds' personality. Yeah, that I'm just Robio. Sorry to... This is 2009. We should be expecting a bit of personality from these birds. Please, why you don't like Angry Birds as a franchise, so... <laughs> um, first off, that's English, and second off, I went on and on and on and on and on and on and on about it in the end of the video. So, I thought you knew. I hate the franchise because, one, there's almost nothing new in every new installment. It's always almost the exact same thing. Just maybe with a more annoying mechanic added in. In the case of Angry Birds Space. Maybe with an eye license attached to it. It's, all, it's practically always the same thing. I mean, they could have just added Space Hells in the original Angry Birds and there'll be no need for Angry Birds Space. All of these spin-offs. And the, the, there's so much merchandise for this, there's way too much merchandise. And not to forget that it's going to get a movie. Angry Birds is it's not story driven enough to warrant itself a 90 minute movie. Just That's just the worst idea I ever heard. And, do you really think all of this is a good thing? That's just a negative. Well, even though they're, I think they actually don't have music in Angry Birds. Well, go and Epic have music. Yeah. Well, first off, they're spin-offs. And second off, they're not the main game. Yeah. They have music. Well, possibly some other Angry Birds games only have the few music. But good things, freaking Transformers, um, please just, is this Stella? Stella, I think it has few, just, like, some music. And anything. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, there's just some, like, a lot of culture references. Yeah. Yeah, I just felt bad for this corporal pig. <sighs> you're just my favorite. Yeah, you, I know, you're bold in that. Um, not forgot about my Hamlet. All of the pigs felt the same to me. Helmet, or I think I forgot the title of the uh, that Toons episode from season two. Yeah, they actually released season two back in, like, October. So, you know, he don't like Angry Birds as a franchise. But I love Angry Birds a lot. Yeah, just it's just my, it's just that you have a passion in my heart of Angry Birds. A lot of app franchises. It's actually my favorite app franchise. You know, I haven't like you use. Like, am I gonna do, just gonna do like a new part of the, another part for the? Angry and of course, I mentioned how successful Angry Birds is. Way too successful. Angry Birds uh, Three Reloaded Part Three, which is yet to come out. Like I believe, like near mid to late February, which is you have to wait and then. Not that I care. The other three, the other ones are, will be at least on during the springtime. Yes, finally we gotta get more weather. <sighs> yeah, this is Terrence. That's really Terrence. Yeah, he's overpowered. Bomb is overpowered. Um, House is a little bit weaker. Well, yeah, the blues are weak. Yeah, I know. Well, it's actually the other one. I was even go that Stella's the weakest, but it's actually good at a few rounds. Yeah, because this is the mine and dine level. Well, surf and turf is from the Facebook level, if you didn't notice, um, uh, fan favorites, which are the possibly some fan favorite that people who actually try to choose their own favorite levels, and possibly just, just re actually bring the, some lost levels, yeah, there, I believe that the flock favorites are possibly the lost levels, it's like Super Mario Brothers, the lost level of the flock, yeah. Yeah, but Super Mario Brothers, the lost levels was actually a thing, they weren't lost, they were just lost. In Japan, while well, these levels, they weren't lost. I know, because of that. I believe that uh, there's a lot of new characters. Yeah, because Tony is like the only one in the, in the Angry Birds crew. Yeah, I just call him the cr flock or, and crew at the same time. Yeah, Tony's from the season episode, so hopefully he might get a bigger role at the, the classic, Angry Birds classic. Yeah, I know, because I just say it. Also, the... Mostly, I just complained about the the fucking uh, 99 cents and the, a lot of, so many dollars that fucking Apple always pay, need to pur just to purchase you some power-ups, which are possibly 
which is way too pricey at the bigger bundle. Mighty Eagles, those are, it's extremely easy. To, it's actually pretty cheap. It's just 99 cents, I guess. Yeah. Um, yeah, the Mighty Fed is Red is like pretty old power. Yeah, just my, my top three favorites are Danger, uh, the big setup, uh, Mine and Dine. Next, 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 next. I thought we were way down with making top whatever videos. Um, short fuse and red money fetters and a ham hide, which is a why west levels. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, well, who've been if they're making a pirate level, the Egypt Egypt level, um, space. Wait, wait, angry space has that. <gasps> and also that phase I saw like so many times. Why is it? Not find it to Freddy's again. Thank you, thank you, man. Seriously, you're not, you're not Bonnie, you're not Foxy, you're not Chica, you're not Freddy, you're not Mangle, you're not toy animatronics. Well, thank goodness. So, all right, let's just just focus on that. Yeah. So I'm just gonna, uh, after I just I'm done with the video. I think I'm gonna watch the Super Bowl. So yeah, and the review is actually really amazing. So. Thank you. He was talking a lot about the Super Bowl last year. That's one thing I remember. For my birthday video, the, your my your review of, with my one of my favorite app franchises of all time. And what's the point of subscribing to me if you're still gonna watch my videos? Now, so get more golden eggs. Why get more golden eggs? Like beat all 100% of these levels, and because there's a lot of fans that just find old golden eggs in that level. So shut the beat. Keep up. Just haven't had that in a while. Get all the golden eggs. Get 100%. Beat the game. Just play Angry Birds Star Wars on the PS4. Oh, wait, PS3. Yeah, PS3. First off, I'm not gonna get 100% in this game. I don't. I'm probably rarely ever gonna touch this game again. And second off, I'm not paying a ton of money just to play a console version of a game which wasn't actually that expensive. On portable devices. Um. Okay. So hopefully he might not get. He might not get to play Hero Pants, but no. I will get to play Hero Pants. You know, it's a bunch of Hero Pants with the 3DS. I will get to do like the first look at the gameplay, and I might get to do an unboxing on the pass in the first channel. So. Or you could maybe review it. Just an idea. Be patient, sir. Not that I'm excited. And also, um, and also, I just in the in the end that uh, honestly, I thought that, that like he's actually opinions of that game. I thought there was like a pirate uh, song of music, but it's actually actually it's actually actually song too from Japan version from Smash Wii U. Well, I believe I just prefer. Did you think that was a pirate song? Hmm. For the Japanese song of the Ashley song one than the American because I think the Japanese voices are cute. Yeah, I know because I love it. you know you. They're cute. Now that you've heard the second one, just still think they're cute. Love Japanese. Maybe you need to watch anime or something. I um, mean, hmm. Now so yeah. Well, man, of course it didn't make you buy import games. Well, wait, you can't import your games because you have because you own your Lord and Nintendo systems. <laughs> You can't import games unless you import the consoles. No, you're stuck with your region lock with Nintendo stuff. So basically, this is actually my opinion, my thoughts on the Angry Birds review on Angry Birds. So yeah, there's not so many memorable levels because I just remembered the like Almighty Hooks, the the Poach Eggs episode. That's just the most memorable le levels ever. Because people always remember that playing that episode. Yeah, I just said them episodes, then worlds or episodes. So possibly pe some people could confuse. Yeah, because Angry Birds is just my favorite. I get confused between things. With apps franchise ever. So thank you for that really great review. So hopefully he might get a review some other Angry Birds games sometime at least 2016, which is um. Did you watch the end of the vi the review? Because I'm pretty sure that at the end of the review, I made it pretty clear if I was gonna revisit the franchise. He's like, Be
And the games are all the same. But it's time for me to give my tribute to him. As you clearly heard, that's probably a no. Plus it a day. Which means it is a no. The new Angry's movie yet to release on May. Hopefully that it might not gonna suck. It looks like it, it looks terrible. I mean, even Mario took a longer time to make his own terrible movie than Angry Birds. Well, hopefully, it, even though that actually got that idea from the Wii U one, so, hmm. Alright, we have enough of all those opinions, so, goodbye, so, good luck for more, so, bye for now, bye. And also, I'm not dead, I am still here, so, shut up. It was just a thing in the video, I didn't think you were returning. And that was his thoughts video. And, yes, it was alright. I'm not gonna hate it. And I'm not gonna dislike it, but... If there's one thing that you should have talked a bit more about, it's the music. Now, you did go into the, the jokes <laughs> in, a, in a bit of detail. Well, not as much detail, but as I would have liked, but you still put said a bit of detail. Well, so that's something, but he rarely ever touched the music, with the exception of the when he mentioned the actually song 2 thing. Other than that, he didn't talk about the music at all. And the angry, and the actual Angry Birds theme, that does not count. And uh, you should talk more about everything. And you should stop going off topic. That is a, an issue you have faced multiple times. It's just don't go off of topic. That's all I'm saying. But anyway, thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And please don't go off topic and please talk more about like the jokes, the, the humour, my detail, the music I use and all that stuff. Like yeah, it was your next thoughts video. Please comment, rate and subscribe. This is Big Bang Bot signing out.